Greetings, Benjamin J. from Ben's Trains with another in the series. Well, a follow-up on that North Pole Express uh, car set, uh, train set that I picked up at the thrift store. It was originally green, and as you see, I've repainted this one brown and installed Mark's trucks and tab and slot couplers. This one I painted silver, has Mark's trucks, but uh, has its original couplers. And as you see, it will couple a couple with uh, tab and slot. Anyway, big difference between how these things look, as you can see. Uh, the brown one looks much older. Uh, it looks like something that would belong uh, uh, to a William Crooks, an uh, early steam locomotive. Anyway, the silver one looks modern aluminum. But the thing is, uh, both of these things, I got both of these for five bucks. In any case, I'm leaving the uh, comments open and see what the... Uh, popular consensus is on what color to go with. Should I go with brown? Should I go with silver? I mean, these are the two colors I have, so it's between these two. I think brown looks better, especially with the silver windows. I mean, considering these, these are just uh, really, really simple cast cars, but even so, they're passenger cars, and passenger cars are at a premium uh, in price, no matter where you buy them. It is difficult to find an inexpensive passenger set. In this case, you can build an inexpensive passenger set for right around $20. So that'll give, that would give you four cars. And uh, I'm looking at brown. I think brown just looks more vintage. Silver, eh, hard to say. Anyway, a striking difference between them just in the colors. But brown looks uh, more like an authentic train set. I think if you put decals on this, Right now, this would look like a any factory passenger train. And these things are actually made quite well. They're quite robust. Really simple. It's just a hollow box with a lid on top, but it fits really well. And it's uh, actually fairly well casting. As you see, pretty good casting on this uh, uh, passenger car. Anyway, they're worth five bucks a piece. There's no doubt about that. And you can run them with the original trucks. They just run... Uh, much, much better, exponentially better with uh, real trucks on them instead of those plastic wheels. Anyway, I just want to do a quick video. So uh, if you have an opinion, feel free on leaving the comments open. I think brown is the way to go. I mean, it just looks better. It looks, uh, like I said, it looks vintage. And the thing is, these things are brand new. It only takes a minute to uh, put trucks on them and uh, repaint them, literally. So, in any case, looking at the brown, I think that's the way I'm going to go. It just would make for a, uh, a better looking set, I think. Anyway, still looking for more of these. I've just got to decide now what color I'm going to paint it, because I'm not going to leave them green, that's for sure. So, just a quick video. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to drop me an email, benstrains at gmail.com. And as always... Thank you for watching.